UB is one of about a dozen SUNY campuses getting funding to help folks learn how to swim and also to train more lifeguards. The university's aquatics director told me earlier today that UB will partner with Buffalo schools and some local community centers as well as the Special Olympics. Obviously, learning to swim is something that's important when it comes to uh, health and fitness, but also the safety aspect. We live in a community that's surrounded by water. We hear too often of many people who drown in the lake, drown in the river, who are up in different parts of the state and don't have the basic water skills. So this, hopefully this program will help give people the skills that they need uh, to keep themselves safe. I also asked Mr. Burke there about that lifeguard shortage, which was especially problematic just as we were coming out of the COVID pandemic. It is still a problem though. Part of the goal for UB with this new money is to certify more trainers so that those new trainers can then go out and certify more lifeguards all over Western New York. Probably quadruple the amount of lifeguards that are produced in Western New York. If we can produce more instructors, they can go back to their communities and teach and increase uh, the opportunities for people to be lifeguards and for pools and beaches to be open. The American Lifeguard Association says last year, about a third of all the country's public swimming pools had to close at least sporadically due to a shortage of lifeguards.